This CNC machine is creating a life-sized Ford Mustang using hundreds of kilograms of clay. This is a crucial step in the car design process, although most car owners are unaware of this procedure. For almost 100 years, car manufacturers have used clay models for the majority of the cars seen on the streets. Let's explore the importance of this production process. But before that, I ask you to leave a like and subscribe to the channel to stay updated on the latest videos related to automotive techniques. Now, get comfortable and enter the world of clay modeling in the automotive field. Clay modeling allows automotive designers to visualize and evaluate the proportions, shapes, lines, and aesthetic details of a vehicle in a physical and tangible way. It is a way to transform design ideas from paper or screen into a real three-dimensional form. Clay modeling is an essential process in automotive design, used to create physical models of cars during the development and design phase. It involves shaping clay into a three-dimensional form that represents the aesthetic aspect of the vehicle. However, car companies are gradually moving away from using clay. Clay modeling is expensive, and costs increase based on the company and the complexity of the vehicle. Automotive designers now have high-tech virtual reality software that allows them to design and examine every detail of their cars. So, why do some companies continue to use up to 100 tons of clay every year? And why do some models take years to complete? Clay modeling is carried out in even more restricted studios compared to production facilities. Within these studios, designers develop vehicles that have not yet been announced. It is one of the most secretive and exclusive areas of the automotive industry, accessible only to a few authorized employees. To work with clay, it is provided in bars or cylinders about the size of tennis cans. It resembles the plasticine that we used to play with as children. However, the clay used for automotive models is a special type, different from traditional ceramic clay. It is stickier, more malleable, and remains workable for a longer period of time without quickly hardening. Before using it, the clay is heated to make it more pliable. Traditional water-based ceramic clay would dry out and harden too quickly. This special automotive clay is stickier and more malleable. Once the life-size clay model has been sculpted, the modeling craftsmen begin to work on refining the details. They use various tools, such as spatulas and scrapers, to smooth the perfect surfaces, angles, and edges. This phase requires great craftsmanship and attention to detail to achieve the desired shape and finish. Once the modeling and refinement are complete, the model can be used to assess the vehicle's aesthetic appearance from different angles and perspectives. It is also an opportunity for stylists and engineers to collaborate and make any modifications or improvements to the design. Once satisfied with the clay model, plaster or resin copies are created for further evaluation and testing. These copies allow for more in-depth examination of the details and precise measurements to be taken. Ultimately, clay modeling remains a fundamental process in automotive design, despite the advent of advanced technologies like virtual reality. Clay provides automotive designers with the opportunity to work tangibly and assess the aesthetic aspect of a vehicle in the real world. The craftsmanship required to work with clay and refine the details is an essential element in the process of creating successful automobiles. Indeed, the tools used to model clay in the automotive design process may seem primitive or rudimentary, but they have been refined over the years to allow modelers to achieve precise and detailed results. One of the more common tools used is a type of grater or a spatula, similar to a cheese grater. This tool allows for the removal of excess clay and smoothing the surface, keeping it flat and uniform. Razor blades and wires are used to cut and shape the clay with precision, enabling the creation of sharp lines and precise details. Despite advancements in technology and the use of computerized machines for certain stages of the process, such as milling, Traditional clay modeling tools are still widely used. 
This is because the modeling craftsmen have great mastery in using these tools and are able to achieve artistic and accurate results that can be challenging to replicate with technology alone. The construction of the model begins with the creation of a support structure made of steel and wood that supports foam blocks. This structure provides the stable base onto which the clay will be applied. Layers of clay are then applied to the foam structure, one layer at a time, until the desired thickness is achieved. This process allows modelers to shape the clay more flexibly and make modifications or additions during the modeling process. The mentioned tools, such as scrapers and spatulas, are indeed common in clay modeling. Spatulas, made of thin steel, allow modelers to shape the clay and drag the surface to achieve desired effects. They are used to refine the surface and create precise lines and shapes. The versatility of the clay is a great advantage for modelers, as they can experiment and make changes easily. If they make a mistake, they can use a hairdryer to soften the clay and correct it or add material. This flexibility allows them to achieve the desired result and address any imperfections throughout the modeling process. To have a more complete picture of how the vehicle will look, 3D printers are used to produce parts such as headlights, grills, mirrors, and more. These parts, which can be rigid or 3D printed, are developed alongside the clay model. As the process progresses, the parts become increasingly detailed and may include different materials, such as painted or clear-coated finishes. 3D scanners are used to create a digital version of the clay model, allowing for quick sharing with engineers and designers worldwide. This sharing facilitates collaborative work and enables timely modifications or improvements. Towards the final stages of the process, the clay models are coated with a glossy film that simulates paint on sheet metal. This coating helps modelers identify any errors or defects in the bodywork that need to be corrected. Additionally, it adds an additional level of realism to the appearance of the car. The finishing and detailing phase is crucial to achieve a smooth and accurate surface. Modelers use a variety of tools, such as spatulas, scrapers, wires, and razors to sculpt and shape the vehicle's details. This phase requires craftsmanship and attention to detail to achieve a high quality end result. The clay modeling process can take years to complete, despite the assistance of scanners and milling machines. Automotive designers may make over a dozen modifications to the model before considering it final. Perfecting the bodywork details and adapting it to the engineer's requirements to enhance vehicle performance and safety. To facilitate these modifications, modelers use adhesive tape such as scotch tape, to attach it to the clay and create guides or defined sections to work on the surfaces. This allows them to make more precise changes and work on specific details. However, while minor modifications can be made manually, significant changes require the model to be completely reshaped based on new data and updated specifications. Once the clay model is completed, a digital scan is performed using 3D scanners to create a digital version of the model. This digital representation allows for further analysis and simulations. Despite the advancements in virtual technologies, clay models remain valuable because they offer a more accurate and tangible representation of the car. They can be tested for aerodynamics, as computer programs cannot fully simulate airflow over a car's surface. Clay models enable the evaluation of how the vehicle's lines interact with the air, influencing stability and fuel efficiency. Furthermore, clay provides a tangible and sensory experience that cannot be replicated virtually. Clay models have an emotional connection with people, as they can be touched, manually explored, and admired for their shape and form. This aspect is still considered important for automotive companies and their designers. Clay models are used to evaluate the aesthetics, aerodynamics, and other aspects of vehicle design. They undergo aerodynamic tests in wind tunnels and are also evaluated for occupant comfort and ergonomics. The tactile and visual experience that clay models offer helps make more informed decisions about the final design of the vehicle. Despite advancements in virtual modeling and virtual reality, 
clay remains an essential tool for automotive designers in the car creation process. In addition to providing an accurate physical representation of the design, clay offers a unique sensory experience that helps capture the aesthetics, soul, and emotion of the vehicle. Through the use of clay and the mastery of modelers, automotive designers can shape and refine every detail of the vehicle, creating a physical representation that embodies the desired design. This process allows them to accurately and tangibly evaluate the aesthetic appearance, shape, proportion, and aerodynamics, aspects that cannot be fully appreciated through virtual modeling. Clay allows designers to evaluate the design from different perspectives and make real-time modifications. This is particularly important in the automotive industry, where details such as the curvature of lines, fittings, and proportions can have a significant impact on the overall aesthetics and appeal of the vehicle. Lastly, clay enables the creation of a tangible and engaging experience for both designers and observers. This physical representation has the power to evoke deeper emotions and connections compared to virtual modeling, contributing to capturing people's imagination and conveying the promise of an exciting and engaging driving experience. Ultimately, clay remains an irreplaceable tool in automotive design, as it offers a tangible way to transform ideas and design concepts into three-dimensional forms that can be touched, explored, and fully appreciated. If this video has sparked your interest in the magic of clay modeling in the world of automotive design, we invite you to subscribe to our channel and leave a comment with your impressions and support. And don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed the content. Your participation will help us continue creating interesting and engaging videos on automotive topics. Thank you for following us and being a part of our community. We'll see you in the next video.